protection put it in the car. Yes, my prince. Where are the rest of your luggage? The guards have put them in the car. I am set to leave. My son, be very careful when you get there. Hmm? Act with wisdom always. If there is any issue difficult for you to handle, call or come to your father for his opinion. I will, Queen Mother. The Lord protect you. Amen. Let's go. Okay. I that kind this life. Once I get rich, hey! Nah, that car is fine. I'm done. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Huh? If you saw the car that just passed here just now. Which car? The car is as big as a house. Yeah. It's so fine. Once you get rich, you must buy that car. We will buy the car. Have it? See? See? Oh, 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 that car is too fine. Let's go home. Are you sure you saw anything? I was in that car. Which car are you talking about? We must drive that car in this town. Once we make money, hey. Hey, the car is there. What is your name? My name is Machoku, sir. Do you live in the forest? No, sir. Well, to start with, I am Prince Arinze, the son of the Iwi. I was sent to this village to oversee the affairs. Can you address me properly now? G -g Greetings, my prince. My name is Machoku Ibeziako, son of Louis Ibeziako. Okay. Yes, my prince. And um, who is the lady I saw with you? The lady that just left? Oh, her name is Chukukaima Musu, daughter of Bernard Musu. Okay, I yes. see. Thank you. One big trouble like that. Can you imagine? I was just walking along the road and I saw one big car like that. And because I liked the car, I just pointed at the car. The next thing, the owner got upset and started chasing after me. Oh, why? Yeah. Mom. Why did you run off like that? Did you see the way that man came back and started chasing after me? No one was chasing after you. Ha! This is nothing but amazing. I'm going inside. Nobody's. If anybody comes here to look for me, I don't live here. You don't know me. You I'm not around. This is serious. She can't stop. Alpha. Ma. Eh? Alena. Nah, Joe. No, just. She just rushed off like. Ha! <laughs> About. Nobody, they pursue you now. Do you see it? Amandi, 
My prince. I saw a girl today. A girl with no background. A commoner. Looking timid and tattered. But do you know what? My prince, I, I can't imagine what you have on your mind. She stole my heart. Wow. If I put my royal touch on that girl, she would be as beautiful and graceful as the queen of the sun. And could even come close to my status. What do you think? My prince, I, I will advise that you go for what you want. Exactly. Her name is Kaima Umusu. She stays in this village. Find her. Bring her to my presence before nightfall. As you wish, Your Highness. Let me get going. not planning to become the, the, the king of this village. I don't know. Eh? You know, my son, we have been trying to stand on our own as an autonomous community. Before they be send him to come and check if we are strong enough, then he will now take the proposal to the government. Mana, give us the I hope so. I just hope so. Ah. I'm on the... <laughs> Where'd you go? Are you now a palace guard? Yes, sir. I now work with Prince Ibeziako. Mm. I'm going to Mama Chuku. You're welcome, my son. I'm on the... <laughs> Are you serious? I'm very serious. Please, can I see you over there? Uh, Come now. <laughs> Mama, I'm coming. Okay. Mama, no, what is there? No problem. No, there's no problem. Just excuse us, ma. Hey, so good. <laughs> Oh, what's up? Why does he want to see her? She only pointed at his jeep, which is not a crime. It's not an offense. What you go see? We cannot know till she comes to the palace. Okay? Amandi, what you go? Amandi, what you go? Amandi. <laughs> How many times did I call? Three good times, Machuku. You know that Chukukaima is my one and only girlfriend. I know. Everyone in this village, even rats, cockroaches, everyone is aware that we are in a relationship. Machuku, I am aware of that. Fine. Amandi, Machuku. She will go to see him. Watch you go, watch you. Hmm. Don't even, don't, don't, watch don't try wait, to convince me. Wait, wait, please just hear me out. Don't conclude yet. And you know that he is the prince and I can't give him a negative answer. Never come to the palace first. Okay? Please. Okay. All right. No problem. Um... Go to her house. Um, I, I have gone to her house before coming to this place. But I didn't see her. But I'll still go back there. Hmm? Come on, it's okay. Come on, come on. Calm, everything will be fine. We've already gone to her house. Okay, man. You have to learn how to control this your finger before it puts you into trouble. Uh, must you admire everything you see? Must you? <laughs> Look, let me tell you something. I admire good things because I love them. You know what? I will have all of those things very soon. I'm going to be very rich, oh. Ha! Uh, Amen. Papa, what are you going to do? My daughter, did you fight today with anybody? Fight? Yes. Mama. How now? No. Well, the palace guard came here to say that you are needed urgently at the palace.
did I do? I told you. You told me what? What did I do? Check him out. But I know that there is freedom of speech and expression. Mm. What Kaima did was simply expressing her feelings towards a non-living thing. And I don't see any crime in that. Uh, it's just that uh, Amandi, the guard, sounded very serious. Papa, mm. don't worry about it, okay? Uh. Everything will be okay. Thank you. Believe me. Thank you. Um, let me walk you home because it's getting really dark. Thank you. Just don't worry yourself. Everything will be fine. Huh? Thank you. I'm the controller of this village, Erindiago. I know that already, my prince. And your house is very beautiful and big. <laughs> really? I can see you have eyes for good things. Well, that is actually why I called you here. To be favored and uplifted. So that these good things can be yours. I'm actually in need of a woman to call my own. And a queen. You happen to be the chosen one. I'm speechless. <laughs> you should be. I learned you're from a poor home. From now on, it counts your days of poverty over. What do you say about that? Sorry, can I have water to drink? Well, don't worry. Let's go over to the dining table. A lot has been prepared for you. from the prince. Keep it well, oh. I can see you're so happy. Mm. You had a good time. I had a fantastic time. Mm. Mwah, if you see the prince house, see it is so big and beautiful. Are you serious? Beautiful paintings. Hey, then come and see the meal they gave me. <laughs> Royal meal. Everything from Kobe to Uba, spaghetti, serious? everything. Hey, so I'm telling hold on, you. Hold on. Why did he send for you? thinking about Kaima and the Prince. My son. You are thinking. You don't want to eat your food. Eat your food, please. Let me tell you something. It is one thing for the Prince to make a proposal. And it is another thing for Kaima to accept it. Ma. Prince is showering Kaima with so much gifts. So much gifts. Let's be realistic. Mama, we are all humans. Who doesn't want good things? At this our level. Or who doesn't love good things? And you know Kaima loves good things. 
And, and she doesn't fail to remind anyone around her of her big dream of becoming rich and oh, Yes, she does. But I want you to remember that she talks about working very hard to become rich. She never meant manna for him from heaven. My son, I am love so very much. I would never do anything to betray that love. I want you to understand that. God. It is one thing for someone to appreciate good thing. And there is no crime in that. Yes. It's your food. Hmm? It's your food. Oh. I'll start feeding you like a baby. I eat. I heard that the prince wants to see the elders of uh, Ndiago and our names are included in those representing the elders. So what's the purpose of this call then? Uh, just for the progress of the community. We want to differentiate Erindiago from Erinduno. And that's why he sent for us. And when? We'll go then. Okay. Uh, we'll go. <laughs> I'll finish your drink. Let's go. The children. Hey, Oscar, sit down. Let me take a picture. Let me snap. Look at this. Take me, take me, take me. Here. Yeah, press, press there, yes. Yes! <laughs> All this from the prince. Papa, let me take it. Yes, the prince gave all of this to me. Let me stand up. Papa, cheese now. Cheese. Chaku. <laughs> it's so spicy. Wonderful. Papa, he gave me a phone and I have GSM. Where's my phone? Wonderful. Look at my phone. Oh, great. Let me go and see my friend Anya off. Okay. Huh? <laughs> Papa, nice. as you're going, let me be taking your pictures. Oh, Papa, oh, smile oh, now. Oh, cheese. Oh, take me, take me, take me. Take me again. <laughs> is not bad, the weather is very calm, but the people here are very timid. <laughs> yes, they are. You know, they are farmers working for our village, Erindiono, why we call them Erindiago. This place is like a farm settlement. The people here intermarried with us and nobody could tell the difference. They have been under our supervision and relationship. But they now want to stand on their own as an autonomous community so they can select their own king and rulers and also make decisions on their own. <laughs> well, that is why I'm here. I am meeting with the elders tomorrow. Really? I need to ask them a few questions to know if they're ready for that. Good. That's good. So how is my father? He is well. <laughs> He sends his greetings. Dad, I miss him a lot. I am. What the fuck, Okaka? Ah, Prince, we greet you. Thank you. These are the elders sent to represent our people. Elder Job. 
Thank you, my prince. But um, where are the other elders? Uh, they went to the farm. You know, this is harvest period. Well, it's all right. I called you here because I want us to talk. I want us to talk about the border adjustments of um, Erindiago and Erinduno. I want you to come up with um, a constitution so that I can submit a proposal to the federal government. You know I can't do that alone. <laughs> what do you say about it? <laughs> <laughs> you see? Uh, my prince, my prince, that is very good. Do you know what? I've been thinking. I would like to go to the city to find something to do, you know, learn a trade, or even serve someone. I thought about that too. I want to leave this village and go to the city to search for greener pastures. But the problem is money. We shouldn't be the one going to the city to learn trade just to make our lives better. I should be able to provide everything for you. Everything you need, baby. You deserve the best. You deserve every good thing life has to offer. And I'll surely get it for you. Amandi, what is it again? Rachiko, do not see me as a threat to your life. I was only set by my superior. Kaima, the prince requests your presence at the palace now. Can you please wait for me outside? Okay. Thank you. Don't tell me you're going to see him again. I'm sorry, but I cannot refuse the prince's request to see me. But don't worry, I won't be long. I'll be back shortly, I promise. Alice must have got so much money, so beautiful. And I know that that palace was built with so much money. Are you telling me? Uh, Umosu, mm -hmm. I think we need an Ono in this village. I mean someone who knows tradition. Job, you are right. I never thought of that. <laughs> and we need to make one. We have to start looking for one. Yes, we have to make one. Yes, we have to. My prince, we need clearance from your father concerning the boundary adjustment we discussed. Okay, I... What is this? My prince, is there. I shouldn't have come to this palace today. Well, I've had you. I will get back to you as soon as I get it. Everybody has seen me in the prince's car. And now my father's bosom friend. Good, my prince. Okay. Then I'll be on my way. Okay, uh, okay. my regards to the other elders. Thank you, sir. Amandi? Amandi? Amandi?
Where is she? Who? Kaima, of course. My prince, I don't know. Come with me. I'm so ashamed of myself. Eh? The other day, my father saw me in his car with one other elder. And now Nichi Akwagu saw me at the palace. What will they think of me now? Eh? What is wrong with that prince? Does he want to give you a bad name in this village? Well, ask me. I don't even understand. Eh? Mwachuku has stepped on my toes. He has stepped on the toes of a lion. He has the audacity to fight with my god. That's an insult. I was only trying to be nice to him. Trying to show him the human part in me. Because I have taken what belongs to him. But he doesn't seem to understand. Okay. I have to do it the other way around. I will show him the beast in me. Now the three of you, go and get him. Go and bring him to this palace. If you don't bring him, don't come back. Do you understand? Yes, my Go yes. right now and get him. That boy deserves death. I don't know why I've decided to change my mind about showing you how I treat people who step on my toes. Maybe because I have an idea of what poverty, hunger and starvation could do to the psyche of a man, a young man like you. Now, I'll make you a fair deal. Yes. Take this. Use it and leave Kaima. Besides, you're too incapacitated to go after a woman. Make a living out of it, then you can go after women later in life. Do you understand? Yes, yes. Thank you, my prince. Thank you, my prince. When money talks, bullshit works. <laughs> In fact, I found this whole thing difficult to believe that you accepted this money. I mean, how could you accept money in exchange for the girl you've stayed with for years? How could you? Mama. Without thinking twice. Mama, I don't see anything wrong with what I did. Hey. I didn't do anything wrong. Look, Chuku Kaima is an intelligent girl. And I'm sure she knows how to handle the prince if she truly loves me. Oh. Okay? Mama, you don't get it. This is manna from heaven. I need this money. Yes! I, I, I need to go to the city and, and make a living. I can't, I, can't, I can't keep staying here, morning and night, looking at your face. Thank and you think the best person to get the money from is your fiancé, Suto? Is that what you think? Mbano. What you Mbano? Hey! You see, I'm just scared of what Kaima would do. That's all. Because this is a slight on her face. Can't you get it? Mama, hi. Money can come from anywhere. Eh? Okay? I didn't steal it. Did I steal it? Hell what? Hmm. What you go? What you go? Come back here and return that money. Come back. What you go? Come back here. Return that money. What you go? I can't believe this. I can't just. I mean, for goodness sake. If money was my problem, I would have accepted Prince Avinzi's offer. But 
For Christ's sake, what were you thinking? You didn't want to take money from him so that tomorrow he will come out telling people that he bought me off you. Arinze, Arinze, I, for a second, I, I actually thought you loved me. I do. I still love you. Baby, please, please. I beg you, don't take this too far. We, we can work it out. I've suffered so much humiliation among my peers. Please. Maybe you think I'm stupid. Do I look stupid to you? Do you think I'm a fool? No, you're wrong. Matuku. You sold me out cheaply to a suitor of mine. And then you, you, you're talking about working things out. What is there to work out? What? I... You know what? I don't ever want to set my eyes on you again. There is nothing to be sorry about. Kaima, Chuku. Chuku Kaima. 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 Ne. I know how you feel. Wachuku shouldn't have collected that money in the first place. In fact, to be honest with you, I was disappointed in him. But you know men. You know men and how they behave, especially when money is involved. Please. You have to forgive him. Mama, I, I that... feel so betrayed. I'm so... Hey, no. What are you doing here? Go to me. Go back to that palace and tell Arunzi that I will never, ever set foot in the palace again. You should leave me alone. I will not marry him. You hear me? I will not marry him. So get out and tell him what I said. What are you still doing here? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Okay. There is no problem. I'm a prince of peace. I don't come with problems. Welcome to my humble home. Please, let's go inside. I am a man of honor and have a name to protect. That is why I'm here. Well, I came in connection with your daughter, Chiku Kaima. Mm -hmm. To cut the long story short, I'm actually interested in marrying her. Oh. <laughs> hey, wonderful. So that you don't think I'm playing games when you see her in my house or my car. Not at all. <laughs> yeah. But lest I forget, is she engaged to any man? Uh, my prince, a lot of people have shown interest. But uh, none has ever come to indicate intentions before me. That notwithstanding, you know, children of nowadays, they love doing things their own way. I'll confirm from her, right? Uh, no way. What do I offer you, my prince? You know, this a great visit from my great prince. What do I offer you? I don't even know what I have in the house that will befit this royal visit. And what do I offer you? You know how much humiliation I've suffered in the hands of your suitors because of money. Look, I swear, I didn't give you away. I didn't. 
I know you and you alone can choose who you want to marry. And, 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 and I cannot make you go against the will. Just, baby, it was an opportunity for us to better our lives. And, and I took it because I wanted you to be happy with me and, and be contented. I'm sorry. Look, if it doesn't go down well with you, I will return this money at once. Just, 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 just can stand or, or take it. I can't stand it seeing you in another man's eyes. I'll take back this money. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Come on, sit down. So, what do you plan to do with this money? You mean that which prince wants to marry Kaima? Yes, so that's what he declared today. But the problem is with Kaima. Will she agree to marry him? Papa, you are talking as if you don't know who Kaima. You know she likes big, big things, and the prince is handsome. She will agree. <laughs> and, and the prince will build a very big mansion for us. Yes, sir. Now yeah, I will go back to school. You must go back to school. Hey! My son. I'm you happy, must, Papa. You must I'm happy. You just have to go back to school. To marry or who I do not want to marry. There is no choice here, Kaima. Prince Sarinze is the one you must marry. Hmm. Papa, me, I have a better option. I have a better choice. Oh, I hope it's not because of Majuku that you want to throw away this wonderful opportunity that's about to enter my house. Kaima. Majuku, I know, is a village man. Oh. He cannot provide us a wonderful opportunity we need. Like Sherudi! What do you know about who is a village man or who is not a village man? What are you? Listen to me. Mwachuku has everything I've always wanted in a man. Prince or whatever you call him doesn't have them. You hear me? Leave me alone. Ah, what is it? Can't you go and marry him yourself? Go. Oh, she must marry Arunzo. Don't worry. She must marry Arunzo. She called me a goat. Don't worry. I have issued a decree in my house. After going round and round, she will move, she will marry Prince Arinzo. It's a muscle, it's a muscle, she must marry Arinzo.
Tomorrow I will go into the market and survey, then see what I will start with. Thank you. Please sit down. Uh, it's much to go around. Ah, no, he has traveled to the city. I've just come to see him. Yeah. But since he's not in, uh, let me talk with you. It's okay. Mm. You're welcome. Thank you. I'm all yes. I know that you are aware that your son, Wachuku, and my daughter, Kaime, have been friendly for some years now. Yes. And... Uh, Machuku has not indicated any interest. Okay. <laughs> nay. Nay, why are you talking like this? You know children of nowadays. My son means well for her. Hmm? Yes. I can't assume what I'm not sure of. You see, I cannot give that assurance back into it. Uh, the point is this. Prince Arinze came to indicate interest to marry my daughter yeah. just recently. And uh, we all know that uh, Mwachuku is not ready to marry yet. But that notwithstanding, you just have to tell him that I say he should please allow the blessing of God that is about to flow into my family to flow in freely without any interruption. I myself was in love with one woman for over five years, but I couldn't marry her. So it is life. Hey. Thank you, Nai. Thank you. I heard you. Uh, uh, but I cannot say anything on this issue. Well, I promise to pass the message across to my son. Thank you very much. I think I have to be on my way now. Uh, it's okay. Let, wait, wait, let me get something for no, you. No, no, no. Don't bother yourself. Uh, I shall be going. That will be some other time. Eh? It's okay. Yeah. It's okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. Please remember to tell him what I said. Oh yes, I will. My dear, I am here to see your son, Wachuku. Ah, Your Majesty, Wachuku no longer lives here in the village. He has traveled to the city. I hope there's no problem. Not at all, my dear. Not at all. Um, I was told your son has been dating Kaima for years now. Oh, yes. My fellow woman, I am here for us to talk woman to woman. You know, nobody can have a huge effect on a man like his mother. I heard that your son is still struggling to make a living. Yes. And I also pray that it will be well for him. I see. But time waits for nobody. My son is so ready to get married to Kaima. And I hear that Kaima has refused because she has pledged her royalty to your son. My dear, I am here for you to talk to your son. Tell him the realities of life. When he make a living, he will see exactly what he wants. Tell him to please back off so that the tussle will be just between my son and Kaima. Hey. Thank you, Your Majesty. You're welcome. I can see you're serious about um, your son marrying Kaima. But I want you to know that my son also sees the same thing the prince sees in Kaima. 
Nevertheless, I will try as much as I can to convince my son. Thank you, my dear. Thank you. You're welcome. Accept the gift from me as a sign of friendship. Thank you, Your Majesty. Oh, you're welcome. collect the deposit for today is almost 4 p.m. Oh, um, okay, you know what, just give me some time. I'll bring it downstairs. Okay, sir. Mm -hmm. right. Money. What if he marries a prince and does not find happiness? What? So far I came to see. Since he's not around, I'll be good. He's here. Ah, oh, right. oh, oh, yeah. You are here? Yes, my friend. Welcome. Thank you. I was uh, talking to Oscar uh, about kind. Okay. okay. Yeah. Uh, please. Uh, please sit down. Thank you. Hey, what is it about her? Um, what's Kaima is your only daughter. And your prayer for her should be for her to have peace and happiness wherever he may, she may enter tomorrow. Wait, 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 wait. Stop. Just stop. So you have been the one that has been confusing my daughter. So you are the enemy of progress in my family. I wonder. Hey. Hello. Hey. Listen. Kaima is also my daughter. She is not your daughter. She Kaima is, daughter. is also my daughter. And that is why she thought it wise to run to me for advice. Uh, Anyago, if the prince comes to your place and wants to marry your daughter, mm -hmm. will you think it twice before you give him your consent? <laughs> that shows how money has blinded you. You are the one that has been blinded well, so by money. It doesn't depend on me. It depends on my daughter. Listen, Anyabu, you are evil. Leave my house. Stop confusing my daughter, or you have me to fix. Hey, what's it? Anyabu, I've told you what I want to tell you. Leave that girl alone to make her choice. She is making her choice, but you are the one confusing her. Oh, son, then leave my house. Don't come here again. We are the best of friends. Yes, we, we are best of friends. Go, leave my house, and don't come to my house again. You are so cheerful. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at look at this kind of human being. Hey. Why do you want to be a pain in my back? You want to be a saboteur to this palace, right? You want to obstruct my lifetime of happiness. Okay. I'm sorry, my prince. I'll teach you a lesson. I'll teach you a lesson so that next time, even if it involves your biological daughter, you will mind your business. Gods. Yes, my friends. KG. Come, son, man. KG! Come here, let's show you where it is. Like, here's my face. Come on. Come on. Please, my friends. Stupid fool. I came into this hotel with 300,000 now. 300,000. I'm sure you have been in this bag. I've, I've always kept it on that spot. 
But look, I, I, I can't find it. I, I even saw it when I was leaving this morning. Then what is it? I don't know. I've been searching everywhere. I just, just like magic, it disappeared. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Look, young man, you should have told us you don't have money to pay for today's accommodation. Because we don't have any teeth here. As a matter of fact, the oldest staff here is two years old. And up to date, we've not recorded any report of theft here. I can't lie. I swear with my life, I, I, I came here with this money. Then where is it? Tell me, where is it? If you have such a amount of money, you should have, you should have deposited it with the, with the management for a living. Okay, this man is not lo looking for any money. He doesn't have money to pay for today's accommodation. Yes, pay up. No, no, uh, I said leave. Leave me, come on, come on. Leave me. Stop. I said leave me, come on. Come on, leave. This is wrong. My prince, let me go. I am an old man. Old men mind their business. You can see your mouth is still running like that of a parrot. Let me go. Huh? My prince, the queen mother is back. I should demand your presence. Oh, great. I need water to drink. I'm thirsty. No food, no water for you. Hey! Give me water to drink! Hey! Oh, oh, hey, 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 I met with the boy's mother. The mother said he left for the city, which is a plus for you. Basically, I don't think you should worry about that Machuku boy. You think so? Yes, I think so. They are wretched. He cannot stand on the same ground with you. And the mother is so peaceful that she doesn't want any kind of trouble. I spoke at length with her, and she assured me of speaking with her son. But do you know our problem now? No. No, sir. No. Kaima herself, the girl you love, she is stubborn. I haven't met with her, but I can feel it. She needs to be worked on patiently. But not to worry. I know how to cajole people like that. Yes. Oh, no. You are the best mother in the world. Thank you very much. <laughs> You're welcome. You are my only son. I don't have a choice. I used to do in my premises. Sir. <clears throat> Sir, I, as I speak with you now, I'm in big trouble. I, honestly, I don't have anywhere to go. The money that was stolen from me was what I wanted to start life with. So how does that concern me? Please, I, I don't know how you, you can do it, but I need you to help me. Maybe you can give me a job and I, I, I can do anything. I, I can clean, I can wash plates. Just to, to survive, please. I, I need your help. All right, come with me. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. You have to stop coming. Everybody's making trouble with me all because of you. The other day your father was here. He said that I am the one that is leading you astray. Mama. Mama, is that enough reason for you to ask me to stop coming? Is that enough reason for you to ask me out of your life? No, it's my daughter. Is it? Don't take it that far. Do you believe that the queen was here? There is nothing that she did not say. All because of the same thing. Oh, 
My only son is in the city. And I don't even know how to trace him or where to get him. If I fall into their trouble, who is going to help me? A poor widow like me. Please, try and understand this. Mama, so you're asking me out of your life? You really don't want me to come to your house? No. <laughs> Please. Don't take it away. Just understand me, okay? I know that my son loves you very much. Believe me, everything will be fine. Kai, please don't take it that way. Your Majesty, won't you come inside? Actually, I am here for Kaima. Okay, Ekaima is not at home. Uh, but I'm sure that wherever she has gone, she must be on her way back. Then I will come back. And I shall stay long enough so that we get to know each other better. If you say so, that would be wonderful. wonderful. Oh, here she comes. Good evening, Your Majesty. Thank you, my daughter. So you know who I am? Obviously. I don't need anyone to tell me that you're the queen of our land. I mean, this mom. You're right. You're right. Please, can we go at a corner? I have something to tell you. humiliated by the prince. Prince? How? He locked me up in a cage. Chineke? It is Mosu. Mosu? I know you love him, but my dear, life has taught me that love is not enough. It is not all that matters. A woman needs security. If you are secure, you will definitely grow love to the one that offers you that security. I want to tell you a secret. I was betrothed to a man for six years. He was and still a low-class farmer. When my husband, Arisa's father, came, my parents convinced me to marry him, and I agreed. Look at me today. I am content and happy, and my generation will never lack. And as for the man I was betrothed to, he has turned into a drunk and can advance around the village. Yes, maybe I would have been a wretched wife to a drunk. My daughter, God has decided to bless you. Do not reject it, because it comes only once in a lifetime. My being here indicates that even the king is in support of you becoming the next queen. I am now advising you like a sister. Am I the prince that locked up Anyamu? Eh? Why don't you go to him? You are here to attack me. Better go to the palace and confront the prince. Leave my house this very moment, both of you. Leave my house, I say. Munsu, yes. If you have decided to sell your daughter for some naira notes, that is your business. I never invited you. But leave the elders out of this. Yes, we will. Your, your Majesty, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to disrupt you, but I, I have to go inside and find out what is going on. I never invited any of you. Leave my house, both of you. So leave my house, both of you. That we should leave your house. I say, leave my house. Your house. Let's go. Let's go. Leave my house.
sun. Oh. You're back. Yeah. Mm. So how do you go? My son, I just realized that this village consists of two major squads. Some men are trying to persuade Moose not to give out karma to you. What? Yes. But don't worry. I know exactly how to handle Kaima. She's a good girl. And that is why she can reject all your wealth just to be with a nobody. But I will handle her. I will spoil her with gifts and sweet words. <laughs> Trust me. That's my mom. <laughs> I'm too tired. And I'm hungry. I just finished eating. What did you eat? Well, I ate pounded yam and salad soup. I'll eat it too. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to both of you. Can you hear any noise outside or anything at all? No, Papa. The entire village should be sleeping, but I choose to talk to you both. Let me ask you. Do you like the way we are? Do you want us to remain like this forever? Or do you want a change for better for us in this house? These questions are for you, Kaima. Papa, obviously I want things to change for the better for everyone. Thank you. Then marry. Prince Arinze, so that our life will be better. That is why I have both of you to make me a better person. <laughs> Papa, wait, do you seriously think that it's only the prince that can make life better for us in this house? As things are now, yes. <laughs> Papa, me, I don't want anyone to force me to marry who I don't want to marry you. Eh? I should be allowed to make my own choice to, 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 to decide who I want to marry. Uh, Kaima. There is no room for might here, Kaima. You must marry Prince Rinse. You must marry the Prince. What kind of child are you? Do you want me to die before I grow old? And why do you want to forcefully squeeze out the honey that was poured into my palms? You must marry Prince Arinze. Um, I'm not trying to uh, force you either. But I think Papa has a point. Just think about what he said. I don't know. Good night too. in the city. It's a very big town as I heard. How do I go there alone? What if I get lost? Let's go. Let's go where? Let's go. Stop it. Let me help her. 
Let's go! Huh? Let's go! What should I do? Let's go! Help me! Help me! Please help me! Okay, relax. <laughs> Sure, you cannot walk now. Get uh, uh, my knife. Okay. Who is at home? Hello? Hey. Hey. What is wrong? Snake bite. Snake Papa, bite. I need hot water. Okay. <laughs> I want to quickly rush out and get herbs. Huh? Right. I'm coming back now. Hey. Okay. Okay. Hey. Okay. Machuku saved my life. From today onwards, he's going to be one of the palace guards. Give him that uniform. Put it on and Amandi here will take you around the palace. He's going to educate you on all you need to know about the palace. Thank you very much, my prince. I, I, I promise I won't let you down. You're most welcome. You're welcome. Thank you. With this very car, what a beautiful car for me. Hey, this world is good, it's sweet. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. God, hey, this is my car. Baba, hmm? Hello? See my car. See our car. Is it lie? This is our car. Is it lie? Yes. 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 Our car. Yes. Baba, is it lie? Yes. We are alive. We are alive. Now, hmm? he's prepared to do more. To do more? Yes. Hey, this beauty. <laughs> he will change this room. Yes. We are back! Yes. Oh, we are back! He's prepared yes. to do more. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.2. 2.
This prince must be a very, very nice man. I told you, my daughter, what an elder sees sitting down. A little child may climb the tallest tree in the world. He can never see it. <laughs> a whole car? Yes. Just like that? You see? I told you. Papa, so you're now the car owner? Exactly. That's what, the <laughs> man, what he has made me now. <laughs> this is fantastic. Oh, Papa, should go and say thank you to him. Please, what do you think? Please do, my daughter. Please I do. won't be long. Let me just go. A whole car? Yes. Ha. Papa, you've become a big man overnight. Yes, sir. Okay. Let me go and say thank you to him. I'm coming oh, back now. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much, my prince. God bless you. Oh, it's okay, it's okay. You see, just feel at home. This is your place. Joseph! What is this? My son. Don't you know who she is? One wine for my queen? My own queen? Will you go on, go on, do the right thing before I... Or else I'll kill you. Do you understand? Yes, my prince. Get out of here, yes, my prince. prince. You fool. Get Kaima. What? You're here to get who? Kaima. Are you out of your mind? Huh? So you all haven't left Kaima alone? If you want Kaima, go to her house. Why are you here? Why are you here? She's not in the house. Then leave! Leave my company and go back to your place. Leave at once. It's yours. I was going to surprise you. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's good. Oh my God. Thank, Thank you. you. Very well. Come in, sir. Come in, come okay. in. Okay. Oh. My son. Mama. I don't think it is wise for you to go to their house for the bright price. Why not, Mama? Hey. It's like you don't understand what I said that happened between me and the Queen and even her father. Mama, forget about what you're saying. Look. Nainos's problem is that I have not declared my intention, so I want to do it now. Hey, Mama, don't worry. Everything is fine now. I know what I'm doing. Okay. If you insist, that means I'll go with you. I have to go with you. No problem. Now tell me, how are you finding that place, the city? Who has been cooking your food? 
Mama, I'm trying my best. It's, it's not been easy. It's a different world out there. Ew. The gods to come here to pay who's, for whose pride price. Eh? Nine. Hey, don't nine me again. Anytime I see both of you here, look, look, look at what look at that. See that car that was brought to me by a man like you. Can you do that? Let me not see you here again. Any day I see you next year, I will chop it off. Nine, this is not good. And you, this is not good, if I get closer to you there. Your head would be in the car. I'm asking you for the last time. Where is your son? Hey, my son. My son no longer lives in the village. He traveled to the city a few hours ago. And where's Kaima? Do you answer me? Hey, I don't know anything about Kaima. You don't want to talk? Amandi, bundle her. Take her to the palace. Hi. Just my prince. Come on. Hey. As I get up. Hey. Come on, get up. Hey. As I get up. Hey. Hey. Move the car. Yeah, so uh, this is the space I manage. The hotel manager actually gave me this when I, I got the job here. So he gave me the space to stay. And I think it's okay. At least I have a bed. It's not bad though. It's not bad at all, trust mm. me. It's, at least it's better than this village. Oh yes, it is. <laughs> at least I have a bed. Yeah, and at least we can be together. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I told you this back in the village. You remember mm. that I would like to look for something to do, you know? Mm -hmm. Instead of just staying in the house when you go out to work in the morning, <sighs> you know, it's not good to idle away. Okay, um... Uh, you're right. Um, you know what? Since you know how to braid, um, I'll search for women that braid around here. Maybe you can work with them or work for them. Hmm? That would be, be good. Yes, of course. It, it sounds nice. I like to braid. So even the guests that stay in this hotel, I can, I can braid their hair sometimes. Okay, uh, that I need to seek the manager's consent. Huh? Mm. But for now, I'll just search around so that there will mm. definitely be somebody that will take you. It's okay, but I mean, I just want to be close to you. I don't want to go too far away. Okay, my baby. Mm. 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 <laughs> my tomato jars. What's it? This is no good. I mean, I mean, I mean, what, what has she done? Okay, fine. Even if she did something wrong, is, is she a goat? Is she, is she a doctor we put in a cage? I don't like this. I don't like it a bit. Oscar, nobody likes it either. But what can you do? You don't have any other choice than to obey. Stop this intimidation. Yes. Exactly. The prince cannot come from a Rinduno and intimidate us here. No way. It's not acceptable. Okay, cool. To me, oh. And we have to go and see the father, the king, and tell him our fears. Bam. Yes. Um, yes, uh, we'll go and see him. I believe he will hear us because he's a kind hearted man. Mm, we'll go and see him.
You know, my friend, way back in the village. What do you like him? Hey, Chooks! Nina Chooks is not a big boy. No. You will not imagine. Chooks don't hammer. Chooks is a don. Chooks! Chooks is money. It's all about every part of Chooks. When he talks, money. <laughs> Look at his card right here. I'm sure you will know the surname right here on this card. Mm -hmm. Look! Wait, 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 wait. I want to now, eh? Is it the same chooks? The, the, the chooks that we usually take to go and eat? Of course! You have to go and look for him. You have to go and... He's, now he's going to help you. We used to help him back in the days, you remember? Are you telling me that I'll have to go and... <laughs> no, 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 now. I am moving. I will... I will just stop him. I will pester him. See, you can't know how much. Chooks! <laughs> can we also go and buy food for? Baby, let me show you. in the US. And me, I just returned a few weeks back. From the United States of America? Mm, America. My brother. <laughs> and your children? They've not started coming, my brother. They will come. Amen. At God's appointed time, they will surely come. Amen. Oh, Amen to that. Okay. Amen to that, man. Chooks, um, um, I came to see you because I need assistance. Without telling you much, you can see I need help. It's been rough. It's been very, very, very rough. I don't know how you're going to help me, but in any way you can. I need to be, I need to be rich like you. Machuku, it's better to remain the way you are. To be a rich man is not easy at all. No! No way! You, you, you can't tell me that. You, wh wh what you're saying is that I should remain a pauper for the rest of my life. God forbid. But, Chooks, Chooks, look, you, you have to do something. I, I can't continue like this, man. L look at you. Look at how rich you are. Look at your house. Look, look at your cars. Chooks, look at your skin. I mean, Brother, man, you, you have to do this. Look, take me as a brother, all right? Take me as a brother. I can even work for you. Yes, I can do anything for you. Work for me? Yes! Come on, man. If you work for me right now, how much will I pay you to make you rich? Okay, I know what to do. I will show you how to fish. Okay? But you have to be very, very brave. It takes courage and we're all. Okay? All you have to do is to go home and think about it and get back to me. Amadi, this woman will die. Yo. Do you know I've given this woman my food for two nights now and she left them untouched? Where is this prince at least now? Oscar, there's nothing you can do about her case. Amadi, this woman is close to my family. Forget all this that is happening. The son is good to us too. My sister is not a baby. I believe she's going to be okay wherever she is. <laughs> Oscar, you have to go and tell this to the prince.
He didn't just say anything reasonable. He was speaking in parables. Parables? <laughs> Wait, do you mean you could not make anything out of the parables he was speaking? It was about being brave and wise. But why, if you ask me, I actually think he's right. You know? I mean, in life, you cannot make anything out of life except you're brave and wise. Else you will not have any wealthy man in this life. Everyone has to be brave and wise at the same time. So what me I'm thinking is that you will go back to him and let him know how serious you are and how ready you are to be brave and wise. I mean, if that's what it took him to be wealthy, then why not? You're ready to be brave and wise now, or are you not? Oh, you mm. go back home. You're right, I'll, I'll persuade him. Mm, that's it. Even if you decide not to do it, you must have to keep it to yourself. I mean, must keep it to yourself. Okay. You know, in life, circumstances make us do a lot of things. You agree with me? Yes, you're right. You're right. Let me just go straight to the point, Machiko. If you can bring a woman's womb. I mean, a woman that is alive and well, you will be as wealthy as you never imagined in your whole life. men do to make money. Blood money. Machuku. Machuku. You're not going to go back there. Are you telling me? You will not go back there. I won't. Oh, okay. I will never cross that path again. I swear. What? I'm coming. I want to see my colleague. Machuku. I'm coming. Don't call him back. Oh. No, no. I want to see my colleague. I'm coming back. Give me some money. He's a squad. Huh? Blood money.
that woman. <laughs> you don't know? You don't want to talk? <laughs> okay. Cage him since he doesn't want to talk. Cage him! Save my life. What is happening? The prince. The prince. The prince wants to kill me. Oh, for prince Sakwa. Okay. Eh? I got one of prince Sakwa. Hey. Um, who will take her away now? Please, 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 here and there. Eh? Anyway, I know that the gods must show this. You have to beg him on our behalf. He is molesting our people. You know he will listen to you. Of course he will. He is my in-law to be. He bought me that guy I showed you when you came over there. Yes. He is going to change. Oh, yes. Please do. Yeah, I'm no leaving. Problem. Okay, go well. Um, go well. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> Who locked him in the cage here? Yeah, I'm the one. Well, he is not an animal. Bring him out. But he behaved like one. No, they shouldn't be. Bring him out now. Will you keep quiet, old man, before you join your son in there? you say that. In fact, I will pretend you didn't make a statement like that. Yes! What? God, Jesus, baby, please, just, just don't, don't think that far, okay? You're going to be in my children. We will have a generation. That's how it's meant to be. You're right. Right? Yes. That's how it's meant to be. But how are you going to take care of this Generation. Just, just look around you. We don't have anything. It's just you and I. But we could still be happy. We, we could adopt children. No one will know that we did not give birth to them. It could be our own little secret. I mean, nobody makes it in life without making one sacrifice or the other. And I am standing here, sacrificing my life. I'm doing this for you. I'm doing this for us. I want you to be someone. I mean, it's, it's not very okay, but we can always pull through. I have made up my mind to give you my life because I just want you to be happy. I want you to be something.
Yes, my brother. Big, big congratulations to you, my brother. Thank you. Now, listen up. You see, you don't have anything to worry about, my brother. The family have received your vessel of honor. And they now want you to choose any kind of business you want to run. Because the money has to come through a channel. With your experience, what kind of business would be lucrative? <laughs> oh, anything at all, my brother. Anything you, you decide to do will fetch, fetch you well. Anything? Anything at all. Even if you decide to sell charcoal, it makes no difference. Now, we have all caliber of people in the government. Oil mongers, professional, importers. Even the doctor that performed the surgery is a member. What? <laughs> really? Hmm. So, my brother, yes. make your choice. <laughs> The Grandmaster asked them to come around so you can tell them the kind of business you want to run. And um, the money you were given is a gift from the Grandmaster. So the wealth you're about to make must have to come through a source. You're welcome, gentlemen. Welcome. Thank you. I want two things. First, I want to be rich. But that is certain already now. Secondly, I want my community granted autonomy from the government. And I'm choosing importation of goods. Mm. You have no problem. We have governors from the Eastern States in our family. They will grant you. Your proposals. Who is the owner of that womb you offered? my wife to be her case is a different one because she gave you that warm voluntary you must make her happy at all times yes grandmaster shooks yes grandmaster give him our communion yes grandmaster shall be worthy beyond your imagination. All the glitters are not gold. Take it easy in the joy of life. Because in the midst of your happiness might spring up sorrow. So be careful how you understand this life. Be warned, lest to go astray. Be careful, and make your right decision. Be careful, lest to go astray. Be careful, for the sake of money. Wait on God. Be careful, when the going is too tough. Be careful, when you face a trial. Be careful, in the midst. Confusion. Wait on God. Wait on 
truth can cause you to lose your precious jewel. You can waste the original you. Devil can only give you wealth. I had to rush down here to tell you what is going on. The elders of this village visited your father. About what? They were complaining bitterly about you. They said you have been molesting their people without mercy. Huh? In fact, one of the elders was crying as he narrated how you locked him in a cage. Oh, son. You have to slow down. Your father is really disappointed and unhappy with you. Please, slow down, okay? is after us. I know that. That's why I'm on the run. I want to go to my wife's village and spend some time there. Oh. Please, can I come with you? I don't have anywhere to run to. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Bambi now. Did you check properly? Check there. Did you check there properly? Beziako is back. I want you to spread the message around. Tell everyone in this village that everything is well. Hey! Yes! Machuku, you are back! Spread the message around. All is well. Hey. Hey. Our problem is over! Sure. I said it! Hey. 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 I said it! The gods have answered our prayer! The gods! I've answered our prayer. <laughs> <laughs> As we all know, the targeted bird was not fired at. So there's no need dancing around the bush. Mosu, I have come to take back my car. Do you understand? I give you two weeks 
to wash it and clean it up. Do you hear me? And make sure you bring back all the gifts and money I've given you and your children. Because I'm not going to give you gifts for nothing. Two weeks, is that clear? Let's take our leave. Mama! What you do? <laughs> Here comes the most wonderful mother in the whole world. What you hmm? What happened? You? What about this, this cars? Mama, I'm back. Wachuku Ibeziaku, your son, is back. <laughs> Mama, the medicine look at me. Hmm? I forgot. Hmm? What you do? Hmm? You? What you do? Mama. All our problems are over. Hey! Agu! Agu! Amma! My son! Oh, yeah, what? You? You want this guy? Mm-hmm. <laughs> you want this one? Mama, these are few from where they came from. Mama? Agu! What are you doing here? Mama, I'm okay. 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 Government, home and abroad, has ever driven it. Hey! Does it mean that the money I gave him yielded all that? Maybe you. Very well then. He has to pay back my money because I'm not Santa Claus.
Hello. How may I help you? I know you might not recognize me, considering the circumstances in which we met. My name is Nwachukwi Beziako. I could loan a one of a Rindiago. I have come to inform you that you have seven days to vacate this premises. <laughs> I can see these little pushers are getting into your head. And you may have gone nuts, right? I have the certificate of authority which granted this land autonomy. A stranger can never ever be a king in another man's land. In your dream, you have seven days. Remember what I told you some time ago? That you don't know the head that we wear the crown tomorrow. Well. <laughs> Look at what is happening now. <laughs> hey. Everything just happened like magic. Machuku is a billionaire now. <laughs> just like that. Forget about being rich. Eh? Wachuku also brought the certificate of authority for our community. The government has granted us autonomy. That's what I'm telling you. <laughs> Do you know what that one means, Moses? <laughs> Wachuku is going to be the first king of a Rindiago kingdom. <laughs> Listen now. I heard the noise, but I did not associate it with my It's better you come. Let's go now. Let's go and join them. I can't go there now. You can't go there now. I can't go there now. <laughs> yeah, <very good. laughs> Let them be. Our utmost concern is how to get Kanga's number and go out. So you are thinking very well hey. and very fast too. Much more.
had to come all the way to Irindiago to give you this piece of news. This village has been granted autonomy and you are requested to leave immediately. I know. You knew? Yes. Then what are you still waiting for? If I were you, I would leave this place at once. You know you've not had a relationship with them. I suggest you leave because they might come after you. Eh? Gods! Gods! Amandi! Joseph! Ekweme! Oh, <laughs> 
And before ever we came, our people decided that after the marriage between Kaima and uh, Mwachuku and the coronation, that they will come and reside here. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> Let us go and tell Immediately. <laughs> you realize that each time you're in this mood, you make me feel terrible. I feel like it's my greed that brought the pain upon you. Don't say that. Of course I know that you would never do anything to hurt me. It's just that, it's just, I can't. I know, I know, it's okay, I know, I know baby. Get a hold of yourself. What of those that cannot conceive? What of those that, that conceive and die at childbirth? What about those that, that, that successfully bring children into this world but cannot cater for them or lose them all in one day? Baby, we have better options. Let's make the best out of it. What matters most is my, is my undying and faithful love for you. Okay? I love you so much. I feel like I'm dying when I see you in this mood. Please. Okay, baby. You know I love you. Baby, I will die loving you. I will love you for the rest of my life. My son, I'm so happy today. I'm so happy that I'm alive to see today. You see, God has blessed you so much. And if you ask me, this is the right time for us to go and pay her bright price. I mean, that girl deserves a lot. She deserves the best from us. 
You know, she stood by you through the hard times. You're right, Mama. We'll do it at the right time. The right time? Yeah. Which right time? What do you mean at the right time? This is the right time! My son, look at you. Look at you. You're beautiful. You're rich. You have everything. This is the right time. Don't you want me to carry my grandchildren? <laughs> I need to carry them. Meanwhile, Mama, I need a house help. My wife took ill lately. She's, she has not been feeling too good. And I don't want her stressing herself in that condition. Yeah. Oh, her con okay, okay, okay. I'll help you get one. I'll help you get one. Hey, her condition. Um, I'll get you something to eat. Uh, no, 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 Mama, don't, don't bother. Chukukaima oh. feeds me like a baby. I might get overweight soon. There's no problem with that. <laughs> There's no problem. Mama, please warn her for me. Please. No, no, no. Hey! Agu! Nem. Ochina Wata! Abrasi. Agu! Elan Keshekum. Dike! I mean, all of a sudden you're looking for the slightest opportunity to turn me down. What's going on? Baby, calm down. You just had a surgery, okay? Oh, just, just stop. Enough with the surgery talk. For Christ's sake, after my surgery, we've made love a couple of times. So what is this sudden interest about my, my, my surgery? I know we made love after your surgery, but it shouldn't be always. Okay, you know what? That's enough. Mm -hmm. Welcome to the club. You've seen the kind of power and affluence money can give you? Oh, yes. My brother is it's still good to be true. Just look at me now. Hmm? You are a lucky man. Your wife loves you more than life itself now. Okay, please handle her with care and caution. Okay, she's your egg now. No, and we're brothers now. I will tell you the truth. I still feel incomplete, even with all the wealth. To make matters worse. I don't even have the urge to make love to my wife anymore. Wait, 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 wait. What are you talking about? Why that? I don't know. I don't like it either. I always have this feeling, this stupid feeling that, that I'm wasting my semen. Like a man is lying beside me. No, 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 please. You can't let that happen to her. Okay? Suppress whatever makes you feel that toward her. Kill it. Please. Kill that attitude, okay? Please, 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 please. I'll try. Do that for me. Kaima, my daughter, this is the girl I brought to stay with you. She was staying with her auntie in Lagos, who happens to be my friend, before she died three months ago. Oh, oh. Wow, I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. So sorry. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's okay. She's a very nice girl, though. You won't have any problem with her. Okay? Okay. Well, Mama, if you say so. <laughs> Thank you very much. 
Why don't I take you upstairs and show you where you keep your things? Hmm? Mama, let me just take her in. I'll come back and get you something to eat. <laughs> come this way. No, Auntie. After the frame, I'll, I'll clean the fan and I'll be through. Okay, uh, sweetheart, your friend is outside, Trix. Oh, Trix is here? Yes. Alright. Oh. Saba, you need to hurry up, okay? I'd like for you to come with me to my friend's house. Okay. Okay, but just finish up on time, okay? Me, she told you that? Of course she did. She did? Come on, do you have any problem with that? Who else do you expect her to confide in? Listen, let me tell you one thing, Machiko. I might watch you play one or two games once in a while, because we are men. And men will always be men, yes. But one thing I will not do is to sit down and watch you hurt your wife. Why should you deny her sexual intercourse, for God's sake? Look, it's not what you think, okay? Listen, I don't want to think. All I want to know is that you're living happily with your wife, Kaima. Come on, man. What is the problem? Problem? Mama, there is no problem. Why do you ask? You're not your usual self anymore. You keep to yourself these days. You don't laugh. And nothing seems to interest you all of a sudden. Are you having any problem with your husband? Wachiko. Yes. Mama, all is well. Honestly, everything is just fine. If you say so, I will accept it. I bought some catfish. I've asked Sandra to pound them for you so I make the salad soup. Oh, that's so thoughtful. Thank you, Mama. Thank you for thank you for always being there for me. No, no. I should be the one to thank you for being here with us. Come. Mm. Okay. Okay. I know you just want to get me out of this Keep me waiting because I've been patient, right? I'll be nasty with you. I'll be nasty with you. Tell him I'm coming back next week to get my car. And God helps him if anything happens to that car. I have a picture of the car when I bought it. When it was brand new. So if I come back and anything has happened to that car, you all are going to be in trouble, fools. About you. I see. So, how do you feel making him see you as an insatiable whore? What? Oh, God. I'm, I'm sorry. Hey, baby. Look, I'm very sorry. I didn't mean to say that. Okay? Baby, <laughs> look, I'm, I'm very sorry. Look, baby, you have to learn how to talk to me alone. We're married. And it's pointless inviting third parties into our issues. Okay? I just want you to be alright. 
You know you had an internal surgery and you need a lot of time to heal. Not making love sometimes shouldn't be an issue. Baby, we have a lifetime to be together. And we're going to share some quality moments. But for now, you need to heal. <laughs> Papa, you practically chased this guy away with a machete. You said he was no good. You, you believed that the only way for us to attend good life was through the prince. Okay, now the same prince is back to claim everything he bribed you with. Why are you complaining? Hell! Oh. I really did bad. Eh? How can I face Mwachuku? I mean, how will I face him and the villagers? Eh? Oh. Oh. They will laugh at me when they see me trekking again. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> oh, Papa, please. Hold on. <laughs> so, your major problem in this, in, in, in all of this, is the trekking part. That's what you're most concerned about. <laughs> you know, I, mm. I don't even know what to say. Where is Oscar? He went out through the backyard. He should be returning by now. To do what? Fetch fire. Uh, Oscar! Oscar! <laughs> Sandra, I, are you sure you've not heard them pouring or shouts? No. Mama, I won't lie to you now. If I've heard anything, I will tell you. There's nothing. There's no problem here. No problem. Then what is it that is making Kaima sad? This time they have money. Kaima that I know is a lovely and a peaceful girl. Uh, no, I don't think so. Something is wrong somewhere. Something is wrong. You see, Sandra, I want you to look in for me. Yes. Mama, looking for you. How? How will I do that? I, listen to their conversation. I want you to listen to their conversation. If you hear anything funny, just let me know. Okay? Okay, no problem, Mama. I will look in. But for me, I don't think there's anything wrong. Everybody here is happy. Calm down, there's no problem. The palace is peaceful and joyous. Mama, you worry too much. Let's go, there's nothing wrong with Auntie Kaima. She's fine. Okay? Ah, let's go, let's go. We'll be going to the motherless baby's home this weekend. We want to adopt. Adopt what? A child. Machuku, don't you know that adoption is not an option? What are you talking about? You may marry or get women pregnant. But you must not adopt. I repeat, you must not adopt or else your power becomes less efficient. Should they have different spirits, they may weaken your mission. <laughs> no, no, no. I, I didn't just say him right. Did you, did you hear what he said? That I cannot adopt? No, 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 go, 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 go. I don't need anything. Go, go, go. Get out. Oh my goodness. No, no, how do I explain this? How do I explain this? I 
tempted to do this because I felt adoption was an option. And now you're here telling me this. I can't take this. Are you, are you telling me that I will never mother a child who will take care of me when I'm old and wrinkled? Are you trying to tell me that no one will call me mother? Is that what you're telling me? Machuko, I will not take this. I can't take this. You go back there and tell them that I said it is not going to happen. Period. <laughs> Beautiful. Thank you. This one you're here. I hope there's no problem. Oh, Mama, please, I've come to spend time with you. Or oh, am I not welcomed anymore? No, not at all, not at all. I'm no, going no. to spend the night, actually. Eh, uh, that's if you know. I have yam on the fire. No, Mama, please, stop it with the yam. Why don't you give me yam every time? Give me something else now. It makes you strong. No, it makes you fat. Yeah. Okay, let's start with something light. I mean, since I'm spending the night. Okay. Mama, you, you never give me, like, a uh, chicken Where did you say my car is? Uh, my son went out with it. He'll be back very soon. But I told you I was coming to claim my car, didn't I? You did. <laughs> you used my car to pick goat feed? <sighs> a pig will always remain a pig, no matter how he's washed. I'll come next week to get my car. Do you understand? Hasn't somebody? Eh? Is it because of this common 2.2? You used it to collect the good I beg, let's go, don't mind him. Common 2.2. Let's go. Um, my daughter, I can't wait for you and my son to start giving me children. Children that will come and fill this compound and eat everything I cook. My daughter, did I say anything wrong? You did, you did not. Then what is it? It's nothing, Mama. It's, it's nothing. It's just that. Hey, go ahead. It's just what? No, talk to me. What is it? Eh? If I've not known you before, I could have accepted this behavior. But this is not the Kaima I know. Tell me, what is the problem? <laughs> Mama, you don't understand. Mm, I don't understand. I don't understand. No, I, I will understand. But, but what, what is it? Eh? Tell me what the problem is, I will understand. Okay, okay. Is it because my son has not married you? Listen, I save some money. I have little money with me. I'm going to meet with the elders. They will use it to come and pay your bride price. Hmm? Stop crying, my daughter. Stop it. Stop <laughs> it. Stop it. Stop, me. Stop it. It's okay. See, you are the best. You are the best daughter we know anybody could ever have. Please. So, my God. This is too much. This is too much, please. This is too much for me to be. Is my wife back? Who is her? She went to the mother's place and she said she shall be spending the night there. So she wants to stay away. 
right. What is the problem? Kaima used to be a cheerful girl, but now you see her in that corner scrying out her eyes. What is the problem? Mama, truthfully, I am worried. I'm worried because Kaima is supposed to be the happiest girl on earth. But reverse is the case. I'm, I just I, I just don't know. I can't explain it. Where is she now? Why didn't she come with you? That is the problem. You see, I asked her to join me, but she insisted I go alone. Okay, hold on. Let me quickly change up and we'll go get her. My sunshine, my angel, my beauty, baby, you know you're my heart, you're my, you're my world. I'll stop breathing the day I stop loving you. <laughs> <laughs> you know you're my world, baby. Hmm? Let's stop all this, okay? Look, people are already getting suspicious. Hmm? Let me take you straight home so that you can rest. And then I'll go straight to Mr. Wosu. Hmm? Trust me. It's time we end all these grievances. Well, that's a nice one, but you have to go by yourself. Talk to him man to man. I will. Okay? Once I take you home to rest, then I'll go straight to your father. Hmm? I will be. <laughs> this is Shukukaima that I know. <laughs> yes. I don't want that fist to be squeezed anymore. No more. Come. Yes. The breakfast is ready. Mama, you are the best mother in the whole world. <laughs>
Uh, Sandra, what did my husband eat last night? <laughs> he refused to eat though. He said he wouldn't eat anything till he sees you. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> Please, meanwhile, um, you remember that plantain porridge you did for me the other day? Uh huh. Please, I want some. That one was so delicious. Plantain, I don't know. You're very lucky. I still have some unripe plantain left in the kitchen. Fantastic. Fantastic. Though. Okay, so I'll make it for you this night. Go. But this time around, I want some more vegetable. Mm -hmm. What a pepper. Of course you do. I never eat without pepper. Yeah, I want it spicy and hot. Okay. Are you hungry now? Yeah. Come in. Okay. Nine. Well, it's okay. I understand. Every right thinking man will do the same. I mean, every father wants growth and prosperity for his children. My son, I don't know what to say. I feel so guilty. Nay, nah, nah, it's okay. You don't have to crucify yourself. I never knew I would be this wealthy. But look at me. God has placed me here. So who am I to judge others? Thank you, my son. No. Mm -hmm. It's time to dance to the tune that we've all been waiting for. I'm ready. I want us to plan my marriage to Kaima. Yes. The engagement, traditional and white wedding Wonderful. will all happen before the end of next month. Hey! I'm overwhelmed. Come on, Hey! 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 Let me quickly get you a foreign drink for my Oh, my son. Thank you. Oh, what I want this one. I'm overwhelmed. I need your help. So what is it? Tell me, what is it? Oh, good news, I'm pregnant. Pregnant? For who? For oh, Omatuku. God. Sandra, this is ridiculous. How? How did it happen? When? I don't know. I'm two months gone. I've been thinking of what to do. I've taken pills to push it out, but it doesn't want to go. I don't know what to do. I don't want to do it here and see. Oh, come on, Sandra. You shouldn't have done this. Kama has been good to you. I know. It was just a spur of the moment. I didn't know. I wasn't thinking. I didn't know what was going to result in this. To this. God. It's okay. Does Machuku know about this? No. I don't know what his reaction will be. But I'll tell him this night. Or I don't know. Maybe you tell him. I'm just going for you. You know what? Just get in the car. Let's get out of here first, okay? Just get in the car.
Tipo... Morning. morning. Um, I think we've seen my husband this morning. No, ma. No, ma. You've not seen him anywhere. Yes, ma. Yes. Darling. Uh, sweetheart. Yes. Good morning. morning. Okay. Yeah, you've been. I've been looking for you everywhere. I was in the guest toilet. I hope you slept well, my jewel. <laughs> yes, I did. So, what's up? I mean, you look really excited this morning. Sweetie, what my first it? consignment just arrived. <laughs> How are you serious? I'll be going to the city this morning. Oh, congrats. <laughs> oh, congratulations, Thank sweetheart. Thank you, baby. Thank you. Oh, Thank you. I'm so happy for you. <laughs> Let's go in. <laughs> I need to make you something for breakfast. Exactly. I heard some toast. Okay. So much room. How exactly do you intend to handle this? It's not going to be difficult. I'll start making preparations to send her to the States. She will remain there till she delivers. But my guy, let me tell you. This was quite fast, you know. But even if you had to do this, I must still be with Sandra, your housekeeper. Chooks. You don't understand. You don't know how it feels knowing that you have 99% chances of not being a father. Since the Grandmaster visited us a few months back, I've been seeing the shadow of myself. Sandra, you know, I have come to really appreciate the way you, you look out for me. And you help me out physically and even emotionally. You know, you're always ready to listen. You fill in the blank gaps for me. <laughs> Auntie, you've done so much for me. You know, when... I lost my auntie. I thought my, I thought my world had crumbled. I was ready to go back to my grandmother before you welcomed me into your home. Look at me now. I live like the daughter of the president. Thank you. You've been like a sister to me. Anyone that comes in here would think we're blood sisters. You take care of me, you know. Thank you. God bless you. Oh, Please, you're welcome. It's nothing. I would like for you to be my chief bridesmaid. Are you serious? Thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, it's okay. Oh, Come on, I couldn't think of anyone else. Oh, You're supposed to be like. It's okay. It's alright. <laughs> What are you doing here? Why are you serving breakfast? Where is Sandra? She's ill, madam. She's ill? How come no one told me about this? Anyway, tell her to get ready. On my way out, I'll just drop off at the hospital or something. Okay. Sandra. Sandra. Did I not tell you to get ready? I was going to take you to the hospital. Auntie, I've taken malaria drugs. I don't want to go to the hospital. Besides, I'll be fine soon. It's nothing serious. <laughs> well, I am not a party to self-medication. So I am going to go outside. You stand up from here, have your bath, put on some clothes. I'm taking you to the hospital. Meet me outside. Don't let me repeat myself. Shameless, let me ask you. Look at you. You're not ashamed of yourself. Don't bite the finger that I pay 
she fought the garden. I brushed you and you had the guts to to open your head for my husband. Stop calling me names. Stop calling me names. I didn't do anything. So I think I just want to be back with you. I did it. Please. What's going on here? I'm too happy. Kayla, stop it. I will kill you in this house. Just wait for me, Mr. Shelly. What sort of nonsense is this? Oh, Mr. Shelly, let's talk about it. Shelly, let's go. Are you going to be ashamed of yourself? After everything that I went through for you, I gave my life to you. You're acting like a mad woman. Yes, I am mad. And I'm going to show you that next. Come on. Behave yourself. You are just an icky thing. It's your child. Listen to me. This bitch. Behave yourself. This bastard. Behave yourself. Look, if you don't. Come on. 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 Stop this. Are we going to lose? Yes. I will do it. I'm making it mad. And I'm going to bring that this house. Nine was me. There is no long story on this issue. You, Nine was once told me that a man chooses what befits him. You called Arinza's entrance into your home. Good luck. That was then. That is how Sandra getting pregnant for me is also called good luck. So you want my daughter to come back home? I am not getting married to Sandra. Kaima is my one and only wife. Tell her to let Sandra be. I'll take my leave. charm on you. Hey! Can you phone me? Now listen, you are going with me now to my house. You will stay there until you deliver. Then you will go back to your grandma. You know what I mean? Oh yeah. Go and pack your things. Let's go. No. Eh? I'm not going anywhere, mama. Ah, is it my fault that he touched me? What did you want me? Was I supposed to fight him? Mama, see, I won't leave this house until the owner of this house says I should go. If not, I will not go. Besides, me, I'm part of this family now. And you for me, eh? In case I forget that, okay, you don't want to go anywhere. Just sit here, no problem. By the time I come back, we will know who is going and who is staying. Chen, am I even my father? Why 
Rádio Cru. Sufoca! Assunta! Assunta! Rádio Cru! Vamos bater! Rádio Cru! Vamos bater ali, filho! Hey, Chooks. How was your day? Kaima, whose kids are these? Oh, my beautiful kids, of course. And whose name do they bear? What do you mean, whose name do they bear? What's my name? Kaima Wachuku. So automatically my children will bear my name. What? What is going on? Your kids? You see, my daughter, Kaima is responsible for what is happening to Majuku. Kaima, who can hardly hurt a fly. No, you don't understand this. You don't want to understand this. All I am telling you is that you tell her to undo whatever she must have done to my son. She knows everything. Hey. Well, no. Kaima has the power to make Majuku well again. How? How will she make him well? What is the origin of that sickness? Hey! Okay. Open the door! This woman doesn't want to let anybody into this palace. Will she remain there till the rest of her life? I wonder. But maybe we should go and come back later. Go and come back later? Of course! Are we going to remain here forever? Let us go and come back later. Okay, let's go. tomorrow at the Bray Square. My sister has something to say to everyone. Would that break my son back? Would that make him well again? Would that make him make him well? I'll be there. Oh. Yeah. I'm fine now. As I speak to all of you, eight more children are coming into my house in Lagos. I will keep adopting because that's the only thing that gives me joy. I pray God forgives me. And I hope all of you could find a way to forgive me. I have come to realize that sometimes 
Love is not always enough. As for you, Wachiko, I sacrificed my happiness for you once. I will never, ever do it again because you threw that sacrifice back at my face. I'm sorry. This time, I won't do it again. Hey! Razambura! Um, uh, be careful how you understand this life. Be one, let's two go astray. Jane. 